Okay, uh, I'm going to get back at it here. Um, this is going to be kind of the fourth set piece uh, back play that I'm going to go through today. Um, this one, a uh, play that uh, a lot of teams run uh, just to create overlap on the outside uh, is really what it's about. Um, we call it M3L, mystery loop, uh, just in the number system as your 10, 1, 12, 2, uh, or no, 9, 1, 10, 2, 12, 3, 13, 4, if you want to number your backs going out. Um, and basic lines for this are pretty simple. Uh, it's going to end up being pass from your 9 to your 10, a miss pass from your 10 to your 13, and then as that happens, you're going to get your 12 looping around. Don't go backwards, of course. Um, so you get, the, you get those passes there, and then it creates an overlap on the outside with that kind of loop. Um, simple kind of looping play, uh, fairly straightforward. In rugby so uh, just to kind of progress through this um, basically how this works is the balls moved from the 9 to the 10 or the scrum line out or ruck um, comes here we miss pass um, past the 12 12 means to hold that line there um, look like an option through the middle here and then we get that miss pass by them to the 13 um, this pass here as you can see and then from there we get our 12 looping and then they would get the ball on the outside of the loop creates now uh, basically a three on two scenario um, where as we approach the line here um, we can either get 15 going through here on this pass here if that 15 comes up to the 12 and the 14 stays wide we should be able to get through uh, this gap here or if that doesn't happen um, then we end up actually moving from from the 12 there, we get that kind of miss pass uh, if the 14 bites in and springs 11 on the outside. And then hopefully we kind of have try time there. So uh, again, just to kind of review the basic lines of that, um, going from the start, ball moves from 9 to 10, okay? We get a miss pass beyond the 12 to the 13. Uh, the 12 loops the 13 to create that overlap and then you get one of these two options. You either get uh, the pass to the 15 here uh, and through this gap, or we get from the 12 there, if the 14 bites in on the 15, joining the line there, uh, we get that miss pass to the outside, and then we can score from there. Uh, that one's a pretty simple one, your basic uh, looping pattern in the back line. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna spend any more time 